I am Josep Roca. I am Mitch Evans, race engineer. My name is Phil Ingram. I'm the race engineer. I look after James Collado. Mitch Evans through the final corner to win. The James Collado around the outside in the Jaguar. That's got up into I've been a race engineer ever since the project started, early 2016. I've only been a racing driver for a racing driver. <laughs> I've been a race engineer for just over a year. I was a performance engineer with Mitch right since the beginning of Jaguar Racing back in season three. Mitch Evans just got up to sixth place for Jaguar. But in terms of working with the driver to develop the car, there's, there's two aspects to it. There's the subjective, what the driver feels, uh, how the car is performing, and then there's the objective side, which is the data. So our job as, as race engineers is to, to take those two bits of information together and use those to make the car go faster. Okay, James, we can overspend if you need to. You've been very efficient in the first part of the race. It's about going quick, but not only about going quick. You need to do your energy saving preparation. Very good efficiency, very good efficiency. There's a lot of information available to us, but at the same time, you also have to remember that these are physical, human, fleshy beings that are driving these cars. Mitch, on the day-to-day, -day, he's really relaxed, very easy to work with. He's developed with the team. He's fully in sync with our unique features of the car. You guys know that the work in between these last few races has been absolutely amazing. Thank you. James has got a fantastic work ethic. He's in here all the time in, in the simulator. He's ringing us up asking about uh, any data analysis that you know we, he's asked us to do or, we, or we've done for him. He's really fired up, really wants to score points, and that positivity is, is amazing and awesome to have within the team. Formula E is certainly a really good challenge. No one's completely worked it out yet. You're doing well, maximum efficiency. It seems to be the place to be at the moment. It's quite a good buzz around the, the paddock. I think of it as competitive science. The time I love the most out of the race weekend is the walk back from the grid to the garage that you feel like, you can almost feel like, okay, it's happening. It's, it's those 30 seconds that I'm on my own walking back with the radio already on, no one talking to me. The adrenaline you get on that moment is, is what makes all of this work.